What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Third Person. My name is Chris, and with me as always is my buddy Mike. This guy's being very stern today. No, it's just I forgot my intro, so I did so it. you just did the... I did it a different way. Anyway, okay. uh, what's up, Mike? Uh, not much there, Christian. What are you doing? Uh... You having a good time? You having a good time over a, there? I'm having a great time, and I, uh, I guess I decided... Let me hit up Chris on our... Uh, Skype chat here and uh, talk about a little Fear the Walking Dead episode. Oh yeah, and then we figured six, and then we figured why not just like we'll just might as well record it while we're Let's talking. Let's record it for the for, and, and and you know throw it on this channel. Oh, we'll person. throw this channel that we that we post on. Uh, yes. Yeah, guys, what's up? Uh, how are you? How was your Fourth of July? If you're watching this after the Fourth of July, which Fire you are bombs. because it came up after Fourth of July. Uh, <laughs> The, we're, yeah, we're talking uh, episode six, season three, entitled Red Dirt, A Fear of the Walking Dead. We're still yes. watching it. It's uh, This video's a little late, but better late than never, I suppose. Uh, anyway, yeah, whatever, man. <laughs> you liked it? It was all right. It was, it was, a, it was, it was some, good, some good stuff about it. No? It was, yeah, I mean, you know, it's, it's, been, uh, it's been so, so these last few. Um, we haven't seen Salazar in a couple episodes now, so I'm... Well, I you think know. um I think you know they did this it's it, this is what happens it takes a while to get into it for some reason. Mm -hmm. They can't just get yeah. into the story. I don't know why. Yeah. I don't know why they feel like they need all this lead up and then mm. and then we get this. But I like I mean, look, I, I mean, it was okay. Yeah, it, it, it was it was all right. All right. So there was some there are some good things I liked about this episode and mm. um well, you know, before I get into those things, let's just I'll get a little, little bit of bullet points, okay? Things yeah. that I that I just wanted to comment on, all right? And you can comment as well. Uh, so we know Nick did not go after Luciana. He knows that she went to uh, Mexicali or whatever. <laughs> Mexicali. Whatever the name of the city. What's the name of the city? Uh, it's like, it's not, it's not, yeah, whatever. It's like Mexico. I think she's going to Mexico City. <laughs> Tijuana for titties. Um, you know, so that was that. There was, that was that. That's even made a comment. Troy makes a comment to him about that. And yeah, he, and he's don't, don't mention her he damn says, name. No, he says he says to him, "Say your name again." He's like, "Touch me and I'll sue you." He said, "Touch me and I'll sue. Touch me and I'll sue. So <laughs> sue me. Sue oh, no, me for what? Sue me for what?" And he fucking helper cuts him. That was a Rocky Five reference. Yes, it was. Okay, no four, 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 five. It right? was five with the kid. It yes, was five with the yeah, kid. Max Tommy Tom, Gunn. Man. Four is fucking Drago. We Tommy Gunn. Oh, yeah, duh. Tommy yeah. Gunn. That was Tommy Gunn. Remember? Yes. Tommy. Oh. <laughs> my ring, my ring's outside. Yo, I loved you, Tommy. I loved you, Tommy. Anyway, good, good movie, man. Yeah, uh, we, can so, do, we can talk that. That might be more entertaining. More entertaining, it would be. Uh, also, another comment I have is that they waste, they're wasting like just tons of bu bullets on target practice. But here's the funny thing: so yeah. Jake's out there doing target practice, but he wasn't target practicing. He was like blowing off steam. To me, that's what that was. And then he has, then he, then, but okay, then he starts to train. Uh, Alicia. Alicia, and that's yeah. fine. But I'm like, really? You're about to go into war, and you're gonna waste bullets. I was thinking that too. I mean, right? they give me the impression, though. I mean, they give they give He's you the impression that they have stockpile. Yeah, exactly. They, I mean, that. listen, this guy yeah. was a prepper guy, so I mean, you could you yeah, but that shit runs for out. Their sake, well, you can hope for their sake that they had quite a bit. I mean, have they been? Have they been to any? Have they had any conflict or wars with anybody yet, or nothing? No. So not I mean, that I know. Not I'm like right. They've yeah, wasted. So. Yeah, this place has been uh, has has been relatively uh, untouched. So, hey, I mean, I I saw it as more of like a kind of a bonding thing with. Oh yeah, Alicia. definitely. But still, I thought it was dumb. Okay, so yeah, we no. so we get right. Jeremiah drinking again, and it turns out that he's just a bit racist. Just a um, bit, and we get to see his true colors. Mm -hmm. Um, but racism aside, I, yeah. I, I like, I like him being a dick. I just, I just like seeing that. Well, the alcohol brings it out on character. Yeah. I mean, he's a piece of shit yeah. and he always was a piece. I, don't get me wrong. I never, I never thought he was a good guy. We knew he was a racist piece of crap. We knew he was a, 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 a drunk wife beater. Like we knew he was yeah. all that shit, but now it's coming out and he just doesn't give a crap anymore. He doesn't give a fucking shit. Which yeah. is fucking hilarious. And he says this one line to Madison when Vernon wants to leave. Yeah. Right? He says, uh, some men have kids, turns them into women. Some men have kids, turns them into women. And Madison's <laughs> like, 
uh, okay. okay. Well, she I was, that was yeah. good. What a great line, man. That was, it was, that was it was, line. it was, it was definitely cool. Um, I mean, uh, you know, I don't, I see him as being a dick, but I don't necessarily see him as, um, a real piece of shit only in because listen, he could have handled Vernon and his family leaving like Troy handled them. And we find that out in the end, obviously, that Troy was the one. Well, yeah. You know what I mean? He was say, he did tell Madison when they were sitting there, listen, what can I do? I can't tell you know, I can't force him to stay. I can't Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. I just you know like his I mean? ad- I'm just saying his overall attitude has has done yeah. a, like a three sixty. Oh, yeah, I mean, and I, like, you know, and I think listen, it's hilarious. Listen. I think it's hilarious. I don't agree with it. Yeah. A lot of what yeah. he says or does, but I, I think it's absolutely hilarious. Racism, yeah. Racism aside, I mean, he could be a lot worse yeah. um, so, in, in the end. He you know, could be that governor kind of person that wouldn't let, like, you know, didn't want Michonne to leave, but yeah. sends people after her to kill her. That's a good point. Um, let's talk about, I wrote down Madison is an asshole. And okay. I didn't I didn't notation as to why I think that, but um basically There must have been something that you were watching. It's that just that she off. is. She just is. She's 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 doing she just does dumb stuff. I hate that she's mm. like now she speaks for everybody. It's just like she she does all these dumb things. <sighs> you know what? I mean I, I understand where you're coming from with that, where she seems to step up right away, but we've seen that with her all along, like with the hotel and everything. Yeah, and isn't like it that. annoying? And, it is a little annoying. She just I mean, interjects I herself, but nobody puts her in a place. That's the problem. It's That's because the problem. they make everybody else in the place pussies, except for Troy, Jake, and and Jeremiah. Right. So, so when she comes here, there's not really anybody that's going to put the pressure on her, or you know, really tell her to shut the fuck here, up. Yeah. And this is yeah. this is this is why not to cut you off, but this is why I yeah. think she's an asshole. Mm. Um, and it goes into the point is that they're trying to humanize Troy. Yeah. And they're trying to humanize him by giving him a bit of a backstory, but then also making Madison like on his side. I don't like it. It's dumb to me. Like, that's why she's an asshole. Like, what are you doing? You're not going to change this guy. Yeah. She, is she playing two sides of the fence with that, though? Like, yeah, right, end, right. You know what I mean? Like right. when she so, was like, I saw how, you know, your militia really um, saw you as the leader. And right. Really so what is she doing, you. Mike? Is she... Why is she enabling Troy? Why is she enabling him though? Right? Is it because she's playing side? So you think that? I think she needs. She knows that they're they're gonna need. They need Troy for victory, right? So she's blowing smoke up his ass to make him feel important, right? That's how he did say. Didn't he say like, "Yes, ma'am," like almost like now that she was leading him. But after she said, after she said they need you, it was after he confessed to her that he did that. He goes yeah. and says, I didn't intend to go out there to do that. He's like, you know, and she's like, I don't give a another. fuck what you did, really. Yeah. She's like, all I need to know is, is that you're going to fucking that you like, gotta hand we need you and take control of it or something. That's what I'm saying. Or... So this bitch is playing the fucking lines. She's yeah. playing both lines. And mm-hmm. she's mm-hmm. so she's she's just, oh man, she's just a conniving bitch, man. I she, mean, she good, good in a way. She's she listen, she says it. She's like. <sighs> Um, you know, when Nick and her were talking, like, how come you didn't tell me that you were going to say this kind of stuff? You should have told me that right. you, what you were going to say to everybody. Um, I think, you know, dude, she's the mother. She's the protector. Um, I won't, well, I don't really don't want to compare her to Rick, but you know, Rick, that's all he cares about was Lori and Carl and the baby and stuff like that. And obviously, um, Madison's doing the same thing for her family. So listen, she's playing both sides of the, of the rope. She, she knows that Jake um, may not have that leadership skill that Troy does, but but, she says but it. Tro- yeah, but Jake has um, like that human that humanity right. um, to him. You yeah. know, he was talking to, he was talking with Alicia about the arts and read these books and stuff. You know, so there's qualities of both of them. They need to find that happy medium. So that's why she knows exactly how to play and what buttons yep. to push with with each person. So you know what I mean? Um, I mean, talking about Jake, he decides yeah. he's gonna. He he's thinks gonna go and speak with, with uh, Walker. Walker. He says, "I know Walker." He's like, "I've beaten Walker." Like, he all, first of all, man, you're yeah. dumb. He's gonna get himself yeah. killed. You know, he's gonna die, right? In fact, I bet you. I don't know. What do we go? Eight episodes usually before the break. I believe it's eight. Yeah. So this was six, right? So we have two more for the finale, the mid-season finale. Plus Game of Thrones. I think they they wanted to. They probably want to be off before Game of Thrones starts. Maybe. Anyway. Maybe. Not that the two, you know, 
hands shaking. You can't. But, yeah. <laughs> but I'm just saying they're not dumb. They understand what the season looks like, you know. Anyway, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah. So I, uh, so I think it's gonna probably it, we we assume it's gonna break at eight. So between now and then, Jake's gonna die. I think that's one of my theories. Is that he's yeah. gonna he's gonna he's gonna fight it. No one's gonna be there to protect. No one's gonna be there to keep Troy in check. But now you see what they're doing is if Jake leaves, it gives Alicia another chance to be a whiny bitch, and also Madison can control Troy now. It's true, but let me put it let me put it to you this way now. Obviously, um, in the end, we find out that Troy was the one that that handled Vernon and his family. Right, yeah. So really, what did the? I mean, obviously, the Walker scalped the, you know the one person. They took the helicopter. They killed the other people that went out looking for the helicopter. Um, but you know, I mean, is that that's heinous, right? I mean, they did kill a lot of their people, but. Do you think that Jake will actually have um, the chance to actually sit there and talk with Walker a little bit? No, I mean, that's what I'm saying. What they're going to do is they're going to take Jake hostage and they're going to show up in the season, true. in the in the mid-season f- finale. <laughs> they're yeah. going to show up and they're going to yeah. be like, we have him. Leave what are you going to do? Of course they're going to take him. Of course they're going to take yeah. him. Look, Walker knows Troy's a, a, yeah. a sociopath. Yep. and a megalomaniac and a piece of yeah. shit, right? They're gonna go and they're gonna and they're gonna try to appeal to uh, Jeremiah using his good son. And how do you how do you think Jeremiah will handle that? No, you think, I. You, know, you think Jake will be like, no, Dad, no, Dad, just just let them kill me. You don't give up the ranch, or do you think that uh, they may leave and Madison steps in and says, no, we're not well, leaving? Listen, or... Mikey, Madison's gonna step in regardless whether we wanted to or not. She's gonna put her <laughs> fucking face in the middle of. Come on, guys. Hold on. Oh, God. Yeah. yeah we she's can gonna, figure this out. Yeah, she's going to do that. We know that for a fact. But mm. what will what will Otto do? I think he's going to be like, fuck you. Kill him. Yeah. He's probably going to yeah. be drunk anyway. You know? Yeah, I mean, he's losing. Fine. Look, he's losing his control on there. He is. And Vernon was the only family that left, though. <laughs> well, there were other people. Then, obviously, after Madison, we saw people starting to return things to the pantry and all that well, kind of stuff. Okay, so that so, gave you the impression that yeah. the people that were going to leave have decided, um, you know, Madison's little speech there. Uh, but, won, dude, how blatant. But how. This is the thing, man. This is what pisses me off. Like, it's just a fucking cookie cutter situation. She comes up and lies to them. And obviously, I mean, you you saw that come out a mile away, right? Yeah, well, that's going to bite them in the ass. I mean, at first, I, you know, at first I was I was on the fence because obviously Jeremiah believed right away. Nick believed right away that it was Troy. They knew it was Troy, of course, yeah. You know, uh, I think Madison first said we don't know for sure kind of a thing. But, I mean, I'm sure she probably believed it was Troy, too. She knew it was Troy. I mean, she they, was just trying to, yeah. They gave it to us as the viewer for us to question it. Obviously. No, but hold on. But now I'll tell you what Nick says. And here's, I have two things about Nick. One, mm. he's pretty smart because he was like, nope, nope, and nope. He's like, if this was yeah. Walker, they would have, he's like, there's like a week's worth of food in there. This is a, a yeah. vehicle. He's like, the horses, they wouldn't have left the horses. Yeah. He's like, Walker would have, t- he's like, they took the damn helicopter. Why would they leave this? Yeah. Right? Nick's yeah. smart about that. Now, yeah. quick, quick aside about Nick. Mm-hmm. Do you think they're making him too smart for his own good? Or was he always a smart guy, just got into drugs? Yeah, I'm no, leaning I mean, towards he, he was always a very bright, smart guy. Me too. No, me too. I played mean, very, very well. You know. You know. Let me put it this way. I mean, I think it's. I think it was interesting when when Jeremiah comes to Nick's little spot there, his little the house that was burned. Um, you know, Jeremiah offers him the bottle or whatever. Yeah. You know, Nick could easily. I'm kind of glad that they don't swing that way. Well, Nick uh, was never a boozer. He was always. No, uh, but you know what, man? I mean, it shows. It shows that he's having some kind of self control. Listen, he's not having his heroin or whatever. He, well, he's, he's definitely doing. gone through. A, a, you know, and especially you know now. Yes, yeah, so I like they, to see him straight, and that's what like to get to your point of of yeah, yeah, yeah. you know what did he have the smarts? Did he have the intelligence in him? Yes, I. I think. Yeah, I mean, I I, I like to agree. I, yeah. I think I just want to try and nitpick and, and pick it apart, but yeah I, yeah, I do agree with you. I think he definitely, and and I like that, and I like that, and 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 they got a really good actor to do it, and I enjoy yeah. it. Look, look, guys, we always we're ragging on these characters and the situations and the dialogue, right? But the actors are they're good actors. We're not talking about that it's acted badly. In fact, I don't think we've ever said. Well, maybe a few times here and there. Madison, I mean, I mean, Madison still is. Excuse me. I mean, Madison is hard. 
um, to to take. I don't think it's bad acting. I think it's I I don't like what they're making her do or say, but I still think it's acted pretty damn well. I you know I have to say I I really I do enjoy. I do. I've always said this about the show. I enjoy the actors for the role. I just don't like the character. The character again. Good writing or bad writing, but mm-hmm. I, I lean more towards that it's just bad writing, and the actors are doing what they can. The situations are dumb. This yeah. show is seventy five percent shit situations slash dialogue, right? Am mm-hmm. I wrong? No, that's I mean, that's what it is. I guess what, you can see it that way. You know, you know. I mean, it's just I don't, I don't. I'm kind of done of with them being where they are. I don't. I mean, I don't know what I want. I don't you know, know what, what I want either, man. <sighs> I'd like I mean, to see we, a city do something in it. Come on, you tell me the city's completely empty. I guess people would have left, but people are living in a city. Like we've well, we, seen the town, the we've mm-hmm. seen the ranch, we've seen yeah. the prison, we've seen the fucking, uh, you know, RV camp. Like we've seen it all. Yeah. Man. Like give us something. Well, that's different. that was the big complaint when this started. I mean, if you if if everyone who's watching now kind of looks back at the previous fear, uh, season three discussions. I mean, I think right off the bat, after the premiere, we kind of had, like, with the rant um, vid, you know, that we posted how, what else can they do? What can make this show fresh right? Yeah. compared to, uh, you know, The Walking Dead? Well, they've listened. They've written um, themselves. They've written themselves. Show me something else. Yeah. yeah. You know, what, what else can we do? You know, show- honestly... No, I know. Show me, you know how how the walkers are handling the the weather conditions that way. Give me some more fucking rain or so. Do do something. Have a yeah, fucking this... tornado shoot through the fucking Midwest, right? Yeah. And suck up some fucking a uh, thousand. And now we have zombie zombie you know NATO. I mean? They have shark yeah. NATO. Why can't yeah. we have a zombie NATO? <laughs> Just a walker cause... NATO. You know, I agree, man. I absolutely hundred percent agree, and I think it's mm-hmm. that's a. They, the, the writers have, I think, I think the show has written itself into this place. I really enjoyed the stuff at the dam. Yeah. I like that. It's a, it was a different setting. I mean, again, I, know I made a comment that I'm, you know, I'm tired of watching powerful people take control over groups of people, even though that's what would happen. But at the same time, I'm like, that, I, that was an interesting setting. Like, I liked that. I, I enjoyed yeah. that, you know, more so than the rest of this this stuff anyway we're you know not to get too much into that let's really quickly talk about how stupid alicia is now this idiot is gonna go after jake you know this is and this is the problem i just hate when they make characters do stupid things for stupid reason and well that's the girl running away from the wolf man in the woods and trips yeah exactly you know what i mean it's it's you always you need to have that drama and and dude does she even like him that much I know she's told apparently, her mom, I like him. She does. I'm not, I like him, though. Have... You like him enough to get yourself killed? No. You know what? She is her mother's daughter. She has that in her. Oh, she's got to put her fucking face in everything. Got to open I, I think, mouth. I think it more is that she's starting to really like him. Because, Maybe. number one, she went to him and said, listen, I don't want you to go, um, you know, pretty I much know, like, know, you know, blah, blah, blah. You know, please, please, I don't want you to go. And then, you know, you're not going to do that if you just kind of. No, yeah, I look. All right, yeah, all right. It's just, it's, you know what I mean. It, but it's dumb, though, right? It's just it dumb. Is dumb. No, it's, it's just dumb. Uh, it's she's just... gonna be. She's gonna probably witness him getting killed or something. Or they're gonna take them both hostage, and then it's gonna be Nick and um, Jake and uh, Alicia. And then it'll give. That's probably what it'll be. See, because now you have two peas of the pod. So now you have Jeremiah, Madison, who's the right, head. Yeah. Yeah. Of this camp and Madison in his ear. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who was also now has something to worry about because now Alicia's involved. Yeah, so you have the you. two main leaders of the ranch yeah. uh children taken. Right. And they're gonna so be that like would, yeah. that would give more incentive to Walker and his people to say, Listen, we got your both of your kids um get the fuck off the ranch now. Yeah. You know. What do you think? So, you think you think they'd ever leave? Or it's just going to be a fucking shootout. Uh, I mean, somehow they'll get us. I, I can see Alicia escaping, Jake getting killed, but they don't give up the ranch. There's a big firefight, you know, because I believe what Madison says when she says we have more people, we have more ammo, we have more guns. We, have, you know, mm-hmm. so, um, you know, n- maybe next time we see Walker in the bunch, it won't be just little bonfires lit around the camp. You um, know, it'll be more of um, something like a, a yes, yeah, but you know what, though? Um, I'm I'm curious about this Walker group. I want to see more. Although it yeah. is it is really dumb, dude. Like 
Okay, so you're continuing a battle. So they had this legal battle, right? And Jake was was Jake a lawyer or something or or law school? Because he said he was he was. I won. Or they were defending yeah. against yeah. them against Walker and his. They sued him a bunch of times, and they were so mm -hmm. they had this legal, this long drawn out legal battle before the apocalypse. Um, which, by the way, I like that Jeremiah. He multiple times he referred to it as the apocalypse, or him and probably someone else, but they referred to it as the apocalypse. I like that. Mm -hmm. Um. But seriously, it's like, what are you doing? What are you doing? Who cares? Like, right, you're you not going to get the you fucking list. shit to worry about. Now, so now when there's more people than ever on this on this parcel of land, now you're yep. going to fucking try and fight for it? You're a fucking, like, you have nothing better to do with your fucking life? Because now, you now, know I mean? you know, nowadays, it's, it's, there's no, there's no. They want it because fight. they want it's, it. They it's want cowboys it. and Indians. Yeah, yeah they see you know that that I mean? is a thriving thing, and yeah. they want it. Yeah. So oh, hey, man. I mean, we'll see. I mean, I didn't watch. I don't know if you watched, but I've seen some kind of spoilers. Spoilers. If you I didn't, didn't see again the, this week, I if you didn't that. see yeah. um, next go? week's um, trailer, you know, for episode seven, I haven't seen it myself, but I actually did scrolling through YouTube um, by accident see um, that supposedly oh, Ophelia. Oh. Is with the Walkers, Walker and his and his people. Ah, uh, okay. Um, okay. I don't know how true that is. That might be interesting. This is what I've. I'll uh, go watch it after this. Then after we record. Yeah. Yeah, I want to check that out. I, I I didn't have a chance to watch the thing. Yeah. All right. So, well, I mean, you know, other than that, you know, it was okay. So so episode. Sometimes if we don't watch that, I feel like we're not. <laughs> I think we should probably try and watch that because I feel like. We're missing something then. Like we might yeah. be saying some shit. Meanwhile, someone in the comments be like, "Yeah, but they showed this in the trailer mm -hmm. for next week and whatever." Anyway, <laughs> whatever. Uh, episode was all right. I'd give it like a three. I'd give middle it a three. of the road. Middle of the road. Two point five. Three. three. Yeah. Something yeah. Like I mean, that. it's you know, it's um, it's it's uh, you know, we're getting somewhere. A lot of dumb stuff. Uh, like, you know, some of the character acting is really good though. I, I still like Jeremiah's character, and I like the guy who plays him. I think he's yeah. done. Nick's getting a bit annoying, but. Still kind of like him. Troy, yeah. Troy's fucking annoying. I don't care about his backstory. I, I don't, I think they should have stayed away from any backstory for him and just have him be a me. Like, tell us what you told us in the past about why he was the way he was. Mm -hmm. The fact that he was, that, that story that um, Jeremiah told when he was in the basement and when he go when he went to go down to get him and he was just sitting there and he said, and he said he was sorry. Like, that was a good story. Like, that's something, that's what I want to hear. But yeah. I don't care. I don't, Whatever. Anyway, good on you, Madison. Go ahead. Try and control him because you know that's going to fucking backfire. So, yeah, Of course. Anyway, uh, let's be done. I want to be done yes, with sir. it. Yes, sir. Done. I'm over it. I'm over talking Complete. about this stuff. Uh, guys, uh, uh, yeah, uh, if you guys want to you know, talk to us, Mikey, how can, you, how can they? Uh... Well, of course, they can reach us at Third Person Pod here on YouTube as well as Third Person Pod on the Facebook and on the Instagram. Yeah. yeah. Um, check us out on Snapchat and iTunes is definitely another foundation. Or any place, anywhere you get us. your podcast, you can grab it from there. That's uh, right. We're on all the podcasting place things around the world. You can grab the MP3 from any one of those. Just check out, just type in third person pod to get it. Podcast. There you go. Uh, and also, as always, if you want to check out another podcast, you can check out RetroSquat.com. That's another podcast I do. Kind of like a comedy retro podcast. Uh, it's pretty funny. Uh, go check it out. Go follow. And then also this Comic Blitz. If uh, you feel so inclined to go get yourself some comics, you can get uh, use our promo code Third Person Pod. Get yourself your first three months of unlimited comics for only three, $3. That's a dollar a month. A dollar a month. Get yourself some unlimited comics. Go check those out. Guys, that's going to do it for this week. Fear the Walking Dead. Uh, we will have the next episode, uh, episode seven. We're going to have that up coming up next week. And uh, I mean, that's really all we're going to talk about. Guys, thanks so much. We love you. Thanks for all the comments and all the support and uh yeah keep it up we'll, we'll see you guys on the next walk fear the walking That's dead right. video. yeah as i stutter that as we go out <laughs> keep watching right yeah anyway see you later guys peace <laughs>